Hi, my beautiful Pisces, you guys. What's up, what's up, what's up? Hit that like button, you guys, for me. Hit that like button. So this um, reading is going to be in regards to dreams. Have you guys been having a reoccurring dream? Okay, this could be in regards to your reoccurring dreams or any type of dreams that you have been having. Let's see here. What is this dream trying to tell Pisces? What is this dream trying to tell Pisces? Pisces has been having some type of dream here. What have your dream been trying to tell you, Pisces? Queen of Pentacles is in reverse. That's weird. I just heard thundering. But I don't feel like it's thunder. Something started rumbling. You have the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Pisces, um, your dream is trying to tell you something maybe about a Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus. Um, or maybe this is your energy. Something in regards to you. Okay, this may be... I don't know why I feel like this may be your energy for some of you guys. But I'm seeing Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus energy. Um, Pisces, I feel like your dream is trying to... Uh, your dream is trying to wake you up to some type of abundance here in your life. Okay, I feel like your dream is trying to get you to see something, get you to recognize something. Tell me more. It's like a big missing puzzle here. Yeah, three of wands. This is you because I feel like you're overly consumed with something here. You're, you're too consumed with something and they're trying to get you to see something far out. So your dream is trying to get you to see something that's happening. So your dream is really trying to get you to see something that's not happening just yet. So you're having a dream about something and it's trying to get you to see something that's happening in the near future. Okay, thank you, Spirit. Okay, they just told me not the near future. Okay, now they'll saw the will of fortune in reverse. So something isn't happening yet. Okay, Spirit. So something hasn't quite... Something hasn't quite... Uh, like, you know, uh, I don't know. I don't know if the seeds haven't quite been planted or something hasn't quite happened. Uh, something, maybe it hasn't been, some, the plan hasn't cultivated in some way, but they're trying to get you to stop being consumed with everything around you because I feel like you're overly consumed with materialistic things, work, car, career, life, children. You're just too consumed. You're overly consumed in something right here and they're trying to get you to see something far out. They're trying to get you to see something in front of you, but you're being really too consumed with other things here i don't know for some of you guys this is the near future and for some of you guys this is the this is like far 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 out in the future tell me more yeah seven of wands here pisces they are wanting you to okay pisces you're 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 too you're too burdened you're burdened here and they kind of with the temperance here i kind of feel like they want you to slow down pisces they need you to slow down slow down they're saying slow down exactly ten of wands the burden that i was telling you about they want you to lay your burdens down they want you to slow down pisces um tell me more mm, yeah here we go okay we have the four of cups in the will of fortune i'm going to take both of these um pisces they're saying that there's something here right in front of your eyes Pisces, there's something here right in front of your eyes, but you're not seeing it. The will of fortune here is something very fortunate here. And this is something here that you wanted, Pisces. You wanted this, Pisces. Maybe it's a family. Maybe it's friends. Maybe it's something in regards to your loved one. Okay? Um, but Pisces, I feel like they're trying to show you something that you wanted. They're trying to let you know that it's on its way. But I feel like you're pushing it away by being too consumed with everything else in your life. You're doing things I don't know what the hell you're doing, Pisces. It looks like this is your energy. Um, it looks like you're just you're 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 too consumed with other things here, and it could be materialistic things. It could be you know life. It could just be you know children, finances, money, cars, clothes, bills. Pisces, they're just like mm -mm. we're trying to show you something, Pisces. It's right here in front of your face, but you're not seeing it. You're not. It's like you're looking somewhere else. You're looking somewhere else for it. It's like. They're trying to show you this, but then you're looking the other way. And like I said, for some of you guys, this is your prosperity. This is your abundance. This is a bit, this is a gift from the universe here. Tell me more. 
This is good. Whatever it is, it's very fortunate here. The hermit. Okay, exactly, Pisces. Pisces, you're looking for something and spirit is like, no, go this way. Go this way. It's right here. Maybe it's a relationship. Maybe it's a soulmate connection. Maybe it's, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, they're kind of trying to get you to... <laughs> Seven of Cups, Eight of Cups, and the Two of Swords. This is about looking and going in the other direction. This is about looking, um, getting confused and going in the other direction, staying stuck here on something, being confused. This is the Queen of Cups. This is your energy. This is what you're doing. You may be drowning yourself in your emotions and your feelings about something here. The Hermit is them wanting. They're trying to move you towards your purpose, your path, um, some type of spiritual journey here. Yeah, they're trying to enlighten you. They're trying to get you to see something here. Something is happening in the in the future. You just can't see it yet, Pisces. You can't see it yet. You can't touch it. And it's like you feel so far from it. You feel so far from it. And you're fighting for it. You're fighting for something. You're trying to reach it. You're trying to get to it. You're trying to progress to it. You're trying to... But you know what? It's like you're trying... <laughs> Tell me more. Yeah, the star. Ooh, Pisces, like, oh my gosh. Pisces, I feel like you have something here that is happening for you and it is happening in the future. And the star, it could be about fame. It could be about stardom. It could be about um, being in the spotlight. It could be about healing, peace, something here that's happening within your faith. Uh, you having faith in something, okay? Finally seeing your ships come in. Tell me more. You know, you've been fighting for this moment. Yeah, Page of Swords is in reverse, Pisces. Okay, Three of Cups. Pisces, stop. You're letting someone affect you. Pisces, there's somebody here that may be affecting you or holding you back. Mm -hmm. Three of Cups with the Ten of Swords. Okay, Pisces, they're trying to get you to see what the they're trying to get you to see what's not good for you and what is good for you. They're trying to get you to remove something out of your life um, so that something here can come into your life. Tell me more. Oh, Pisces. Yeah, five of cups. Yeah, it's time for that shit to go. It's time for it to go, Pisces. You have to remove something here out of your life. You can't keep um ugh. Gosh, Pisces, there's something coming in, okay? There's a connection, maybe a spiritual connection, a partnership, a decision, um, something rather big, a blessing. Um, I feel like, Pisces, you are... Oh, okay, they're trying to say that you're still, you're still, like, you're still trying to fight for something here that's just no longer serving you. It's like you're steady trying to fight for something that's just no longer serving you. They're trying to move you to a higher level somewhere in your life. This could be career, family, friends, goals, dreams, aspiration, um, relationships, partnerships. But they feel like you're still fighting here for this situation. Like you're still fighting for something here. And it's like they're trying to move you away from that with the will of fortune. They're trying to move you past that. They're trying to move you away from that. Two of cups, soulmate connection. Yeah. Um, yeah, five of swords, Pisces. Mm -mm. Pisces, at this point, they're trying to let me know. They're trying to, they're, okay. They want me to tell you that at this point, the only person that you're in war with at this point, the only person that you are um, in a battle here with is, this is five, five. You can't change anybody, Pisces. You can't change anyone but your outcome, but yourself. Um, and they, they're letting me know that the more you try to fight this, the more you try to fight this, it's just to the point where it's just going to keep you, hold you back. Eight of Cups in reverse. Um, it's going to hold you back. And they don't want you to be held back anymore. Pisces, they don't want you to be held back any longer. Tell me more. Yeah, because this is what you're beginning to be, the hangman. This is you not walking away from emotional disappointments. This is you staying stuck in a rut. This is you um, being the martyr. This is you like, you know, yeah, they don't want you to do that. 
because you are the empress. You can be the empress or you can be the emperor here in a situation here. Okay, you can take control or dominate a situation. Um, you can have growth and abundance here, but you got to lay your burdens down. You have to lay something to rest. Something has to go. Some, something is no longer serving you. Okay, it's holding you back and it's holding you down. It is, it's really a burden here, Pisces. It's a burden here. And I feel like you may be like crying over spilled milk and still wanting to talk about it, still wanting to give it your energy, still wanting to win something back, still wanting to, but it's like no more, no more, no more can you give this energy, no more can you talk about it, no more can you be about this. Yeah, three of pentacles. Ooh, Pisces. Tell me more. Yeah, the magician, Pisces. I kind of really feel like, oh, I'm upset with you. Okay, so Pisces, I feel like it's like you're trying to, um, you're trying to manifest something to work. You're trying to manifest something to work. Um, tell me more. Yeah, five of wands, five, five, five. Mm-hmm. Okay, Pisces, there's something here that you're trying to manifest to work. You're trying to make something work here or manifest something here. And I feel like spirit is trying to move you in another direction. And I feel like 555, 555 five, five, five is a major, uh, is a big number here. It speaks of change, big major changes here with the Wheel of Fortune. Um, so I do feel like there may be a lot of um, drama, a lot of arguments, a lot of beef, a lot of uh, pettiness, a lot of... Um, drama here a lot of chaos and i feel like um what's going on is that i feel like um it's being it's being like manifested it's being multiplied here okay i feel like they're trying to let you know that something here is just not going to work um but they feel like you're trying to be the martyr here but they're telling you this is not going to work Pisces, this is like new love or a new beginning in love with somebody, or this is like something that you maybe think you truly wanted, or you feel like you really wanted this, or you feel like this is what you may have felt like you your, was your wish fulfillment, and they feel like you may be trying to manipulate the situation, or the situation is being manipulated more than it needs to be. Um, and it feels like you're determined okay it feels like you're determined here for some of you guys this is somebody in your life doing this towards you um but it feels like your energy pisces it's like you being determined here to um stay in this place like of disappointment and chaos okay and it's time to move past that uh, it's time to move forward here with that um, because it's like something is not working out or um, something is just not working someone's not willing to work together on this situation or work with you on this situation um so it's like at this point they just kind of want you to i don't know it feels like an energy of they kind of want you to let go pisces they want you to let go pisces they want you to let go of the outcome let go of this outcome here let go of you know looking too far into it like they just want you to let go of this outcome let it be I'm, I'm hearing they want you to let this be here, Pisces. Let it be. I don't know. I feel like you need to let this be, Pisces. Let it be. Let go of control. Oh, goodness. I just said let it be. For some of you guys, this could be a marriage or a commitment here. Um, this situation involves marriage. And I just saw release your ex. The time has come for you to clear your energy, Pisces. And then express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. See? Pisces, I feel like for some of you guys, this have to do with somebody you're committed to or married to. And for some of you guys, this have to do with finances and career. Okay. You could be married to somebody. It could have to do with financial institution, careers. For some of you guys, this could have to do with your job. This could have to do with the place where you work. For some of you guys, this could have to do with somewhere where there's a financial issue involved. I feel like you need to 
let go release your ex the time is coming you need to clear your energy of this you need to get this out of your energy yeah because this is ultimately like I don't know, it's, it's ungrounding you in some way here, okay? And it's also affecting you being able to manifest things for yourself, okay? For your highest good. So they want you to clear your energy. They want you to release yourself from this um, and express your love here. It's like, I don't know, there's some type of expectation maybe that you're wanting from someone. Maybe they wanted you to just release yourself from the outcome of the situation. I feel like this has a lot to do with somebody wanting to, somebody to open up or communicate or express their love to them or make some type of gesture towards them. Them. Uh, they want you to let go of that tell me more yeah trust the situation um is calling for you to have faith okay so yeah i kind of feel like yeah this is like you trusting the universe pisces okay they may want you to really trust the universe because at this point you can't put your trust in man here okay whatever you do you really can't put your trust in man release your um x and trust release your uh, x and trust that's the message i need to get to pisces here Okay, release your ex and trust. Yeah, true love. Okay, true love. Uh, this is the romance of a lifetime. Express your love and trust. Yeah, free yourself. I just told you. Yeah, it's time to yeah, it's time to take back control of your life. Pisces, you can't control. Okay. Some of you guys are really trying to manifest something here, but. Um, I don't know. It just doesn't feel like it's being done the right way because it's one of those things where you have to set it and forget it. So I feel like when you're manifesting and, you know, um, when you're manifesting something, you have to let it, you have to just let it be. Um, so it, you can't control something here. You have to allow the universe to do what it needs to do. You have to trust the universe, Pisces. You have to trust the universe. You have to trust the universe. I'm sorry. Not some of you guys believe in that, but you have to trust a higher power. You have to trust God. You have to trust in spirit. You have to trust this. You have to release it. Um, okay. You have to release yourself from something here. Okay. Yeah. Because there's a higher purpose. There's a higher purpose here or a higher power. Uh, the will of fortune with the with the hermit here. There's some type of higher purpose to this. Okay, um, like there's a there's a higher reasoning to the situation, um, and I feel like it's it has a lot to do with your your the your divine purpose, your 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 purpose, your path. Um, there's a lot of wisdom here that's coming that's going to be imparted upon you, like with this situation too. So yeah, you're learning. You're gonna learn. I feel like this is teaching you too how to this is teaching you how to because you can't be in this energy you can't be in this energy trying to manifest the things that you want because i feel like for some of you guys you're trying to manifest a commitment a marriage a taurus or maybe you're just trying to manifest something to um regulate for you in some way um some type of fairness you know what i'm saying some type of rules or something here that you're trying to see happen but you can't you can't do that if you don't trust in the universe you got to trust yeah this is something that you want but you have to lay your burdens down you have to you have to know how to let go of it you have to release it you have to let it go okay in order for things to manifest in order for the universe to do what they need to do okay you have to trust in something higher than yourself too um, or in your higher self you have to trust that if you feel like you are a god and you feel like there's a god in me and everybody believes is different well they you have to trust that whatever it is that you are doing is going to work for your highest good and you have to let it go Pisces. okay um that's how you manifest what you want ultimately if not you're going to manipulate your you're going to manipulate it or you're you're not standing in your power because you feel like something is not going to work or something not going to happen okay 